Hello, in this lecture, I try to um, clarify the exponential probability distribution. It is a, it is a continuous probability distribution. And uh, a continuous probability distribution will be considered as, um, as, as an exponential probability distribution when the continuous probability distribution, um, when the continuous probability, probability distribution describes the time it takes to complete the tax. Okay. For example, a truck takes um, the time to load to load it, and the time it uh, requires to unload um, are the are the exponential random variable here. Okay, so um, so the time it require it requires to to complete the tax is the matter of concern in the exponential probability distribution. Now, now look here is the definition. A continuous probability distribution describing the time it takes to complete a tax is called exponential probability distribution. As an example, we can say that the time required to unload a truck, the time required to load a truck, and um, and the time and the time uh, and 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 the time the between the between 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 interval of um, uh, of a car wash. Of a car or of a car wash. So this type of this type of examples are there. You can you can you can you can you can you can mention. So there are uh, so many examples examples you can uh, you can use in case of exponential probability distribution. The time between intervals um, at a car wash is also um, also the also the exponential distribution probability distribution. So um, exponential probability density function is there. You can find the exponential probability density function where um, this is the this is the this is the probability. This is the probability probability and here x uh, x is the uh, is, uh, for an example is the exponential. It is it is an exponential random variable. That is the in our example we can say that the time um, the time of unloading. The time of unloading. Okay, so um, so f x equal to one by mu e to the power minus x um, by mu. Okay, here mu is the average. Average. It is the mean. It is the mean, and e is is a, um, is the number that is two point seven one eight two eight, and um, and x is the x is the exponential random variable. So, okay. Now, um, as an example, we can say um, to unload a truck, average time required is 20 minutes. Okay, average time required is 20 minutes to unload a truck. So the appropriate probability density function is this. This is the appropriate probability density function. Probability density function, one by 20, 20 is the average time. And and e is the number and x is the random exponential random variable by 20. Okay, x is a x. You must remember that x is a number that is uh, equal to zero or more than zero. Okay, if x equal to zero, that is um, that is uh, here the unloading unloading time is zero. Then we put zero here and in place of x um, and we can, we put zero. So ultimately, solving this part, we get the value 0 0.05, 0 0.05, okay? So now we put this value in our graphical plot. Look at this, the exponential probability distribution curve on the basis of our example. Here on the horizontal axis, we measure the exponential random variable, exponential random variable, that is, that is, uh, that is, the unloading time that is the unloading time and here is the probability here is the probability okay and on the vertical axis it measures the probability so when when the x is zero the probability is 0 0.05 now look x is zero it means this point and probability is 0 0.05 so exponential probability distribution curve starts from this point this is the intersection point from this point, it it begins, and this is the this is the exponential probability distribution curve. Okay, 
now 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 look at an example if you have a clear um, if you have a clear understanding over this uh, over this um, concept that is the exponential probability distribution then uh, you should um, understand this example very carefully find out the probability that the truck the find out the probability that the truck takes 4 minutes only to unload and the probability that it takes between 4 minutes and 16 minutes okay here unloading time is between 4 minutes and 16 minutes and there is another um, another um, uh, exponential random variable that is um, that is the time uh, uh, less than 4 minutes less than 4 minutes equal to or less than 4 minutes so, so one information is given that is the average time is um, is 20 minutes average Average time is 20 minutes. So now, now this is uh, now the solution starts from here. Formula for computing exponential distribution probabilities is this formula. Okay, this is the formula on the basis um, we will find the probability. We will find the probability. So here x x x is the unloading time, unloading time, and d is a number that is the time number and one minus e to the power minus d by mu. It is the it is the mean. It is the mean and it is the time. Okay, it is the time that is four um, or four. Um, or it is the value of x actually. It is the value of x. It may be uh, less than equal to sixteen or greater than equal to four. Um, greater than equal to four. This type of values um, we can put here. And uh, the probability that it takes four minutes or less. Four minutes or less then d will be 4 d will be 4 so unloading time x is the unloading time is is an exponential and a variable and here 4 d is 4 now 1 minus e to the power minus 4 by 20 d is the 4 mu is the 20 so 4 by 20 and after solving this simple simple form we get the value 0 0.1813 0 0.1813 okay now the probability that it takes 16 minutes or less 16 minutes or less it is 4 minutes or less and now we will find out the, the probability the traffic to unload um, 16 minutes or less okay. in this case the a d is 16 d is 16 so 1 minus e to the power minus 16 by 20 after solving this form, we get 0 0.5507. So the probability that it takes 4 minutes and 16 minutes to unload, so the probability it takes 4 minutes and 16 minutes, that is, the, the, uh, it takes between 4 minutes and 16 minutes, x less than equal to, um, uh, 4 less than equal to x less than equal to 16. In that case, in that case, um, this is the probability, this is the probability that track the track takes 16 minutes or less is 0 0.5507 and this is the probability the probability that the track takes four minutes or less this is the this is this is the uh, this is the probability 0 0.1813 so uh, uh, so after subtracting the value um, 0 0.1813 from 0 0.5507 we get we get the probability that the truck takes between four minutes and 16 minutes to unload to unload okay this is this is an example of the exponential probability distribution function so i hope uh, you got uh, the point and uh, you have cleared your concept and um, and uh, what is the uh, exponential probability distribution function and what is the um, and what is the exponential random variable and um, and here is an example so you have i hope you enlist your you have enlisted your knowledge and thank you for enjoying this lecture